Um, if, okay. Uh, this is, um, today I'm going to be playing a game I haven't actually made any videos on. This is one here, I'm making this video because there are no real guides or tactics to it. It just came out for iOS uh, just a little while ago, actually. If you're wondering what this thing here is, it's so that some apps don't actually record using this app. So you have to use that thing, and if you use that thing, it works. Now, I'm not actually sure that, that this app doesn't work without it. I just thought I'd use this to make sure. Um, also... When you play this game, there are a few tips, like, if you've seen the side planet commander under that, it says, if you're using a cruiser, turn your broadside, which is your side, if no one knows, to activate additional hull guns. Um, that actually also works with destroyers, like this one here. Um, I spent a little money on this one. It's a epic. All your other ships are, like, common. These are the normal ones. I spent like I think four dollars on this thing. It's usually ten. Plus I got a bunch of extra money, so I upgrade it. Um, I'll do the f few quick things. Spare parts. Um, you can go and buy stuff in here. For example, oh, me and don't wait. Am I sure? I thought that was like a. Oh, this is the one that cost a bunch. I'm just going to buy this because. Uh, I can't have enough epic weapons, really. I'll be getting a few new... Which one should I equip it on? Probably this guy here. Um, I'm trying to get all my ships to have epic. Okay, I got that. What else? Oh, I also have this. Yeah, this equip. It'll actually be slightly better here. Um, here, ship's inventory. This here I will replace with a dual barrel. Um, so this is all basic stuff. Here you can like get paint jobs when you go into ship's inventory. You can equip that stuff. Um, you got improvements, which are your upgrades. Your ship I'm not really improving because I don't feel like I'll be using it for that much longer. It's my next ship to go, even though it's fairly fast. I like it a bit. Um, you can get different paint jobs. I got both these. Um, you can get this. You can get this. Now, those cost those things. I'm not actually sure what they're called, but they're just expensive stuff. Map, you click on that to go into battle. I'm doing team fight. A level 20 unlock survival. Um, I haven't ever played that. And when it says you're placed among top 50 best players, that is your ranking, basically. I usually get try to get in 15 each day, top 15 players in the world each day. Because then you get an epic weapon from a chest. So you don't actually have to spend that extra money. Now, I'm actually right now saving up because I feel like I'll be getting level 15 pretty soon. And, oh yeah, there. It says, under plan commander, it says, destroyer. Equip it with torpedoes. Such torpedoes. One such torpedo can disable an entire ship. Something like that. I didn't read the whole thing, actually. Um, sometimes I get one where it won't actually load. I don't know if that's just me or it's a glitch with the game. This will happen. And then you gotta go back. Sorry about that, but it's a little glitch thing that happens. So. How about this? I'll actually use this thing here that I'm moving around. I will use that thing to underline what I'm reading so you can tell where it is next time. But it gives you little tips there. So make sure when you engage with, for example, Olympia, you use um, you use your broadsides. It's very important and will get you a lot more kills. Um, also, right here, uh, wait, wait, wait. come on, thingy, under that that eleven and ten, that's the amount of seconds that it has. If you see it jumping around the place, that's because somebody extra joined or. Something changed, so it made it load a little quicker. Here, that's supposed to be your loading. That kind of, oh, that was the soda opening behind me. Sorry about that. Um, ugh. Unable to connect. This is really not working. Sorry. I uh, will hopefully get a good battle in here. I'll just try to think of something to talk about till then. Um, 
There are a bunch of different classes of weapons. Epic. Um, legendary. Epics, I think, pink. Legendary is gold. Um, blue is rare and, like, normal whitish. That is, um, that's common, I think. I'm about to sneeze, sorry. <coughs> okay, I'm kind of sick right now, so. Anyway. Hopefully this will load, okay. Um, so if you hear me blowing my nose, that's why. Um, pick, you can touch down here to pick what you want. I accidentally just kind of show you around. You can choose, okay, so this thing, I'm going to move this up to there. Because I'm not quitting, most likely. 90, the 99 right there is your speed. That's zoom in. This is control. Up, down, side, side. Um, just swiping in the bottom of the screen near those torpedo signs. That's the rest. I need to blow my nose real quick. <coughs> I'm sorry about that, but I'm going to fire my long-range missiles. Um, I'm going to rise up to try to hit this guy. This ship does not have broadside guns, so I don't need to worry about that. But I, th I think all of them kind of have some broadside guns. Because I see some right there, but they're near strong. Okay, I'm trying to shoot these guys here. I'm moving around. you got to keep moving. That's one of the critical things. Fire a few torpedoes. Well, those are actually missiles. They're torpedoes, too, but... Um... You just gotta keep out of the average rain of fire and rain bullets on them. My goal is always to kill more than I lose. If I kill three players and then I die, I killed more than I die. So I cause more good for my team than I cause bad. I'm turning here, and I'm coming at them. Now this ship here, I'm going to try to keep like this, because I, you have additional guns. But, um, you have those ones that I clicked aren't your only guns. I'm going to see if I can last this whole round with this thing. But I won't be able to, I don't think. I'll probably use the one I sp spent real money on, the Olympia, to finish off this round. There's somebody behind me. I don't know if actually smashing into things counts. I'm gonna die in a few seconds. Uh, there. Okay, I'm gonna pick Olympia. Choose waypoint right there, right there. I'll choose right in the center. Um, revive means you don't have to wait that extra few seconds. Oh, I won. Alright, well, my team won. I didn't do that good. Um, that's your stats. The target is how many you killed. The handshake is how many you assisted. And the other thing, I have no idea what it is. I can't even really remember what the symbol is. Um, at different levels, you unlock different ships. I will show you how to buy ships and stuff. It kind of, you know what, actually, it gives you a battle tutorial, like what the in-battle buttons are, but other than that, it doesn't really give you anything. I leveled up to level 14. I need to get, my goal right now is to get to level 15. So, you click on the ship, or whatever ship you don't want, you click change ship. You'll get this list. Uh, the target... I think is the is the damage per second that can change depending on the weapons you have. Um, armor that's your health. The speed is speed, of course. It has uh, some stat stuff down here that you can read. I don't really read that, and it's got the price with under the buy. Um, these, the purple, all cost money. I'm trying to get some of these because. This is my Olympia. I got it for a deal. Occasionally you'll get a deal in the shop. This nuclear missile here does massive damage. But it can also hurt you. It hurts other people and you. I can get these ships. And they're different classes. This ship here is probably the next one I will try to get. Or this one. Because they're both high level. 
I will probably wait till I have a bunch of money saved up. My mom lets me like spend video, like, get money to spend on video games. This is the top ship. This is a legendary. You see the legendary weapons, the yellow. The ship is yellow. Um, there's that stuff yellow. Those are special. I don't have anything special yet. I will do a video on that soon, but I don't have any at the moment. Um, so that's how you buy new ships. And that's like battle tactics are probably the one part that I've seen people buy ships and stuff. So I, that's kind of how I learned that. I also just like exploring around your hangar. It's probably a good idea to do that. Just don't buy too much of something. For example, you can get hangar slots. My next one's a thousand, but there's one for only one hundred, which allows you to get three ships. That's the first thing you should buy. Next thing you should buy. What I suggest is a ship to fit in those. I bought one that costed real money. You don't have to, though. You can buy any ship. Um, also, the attack power down there. You see how much high that is and how low these are? The ones that cost real money are substantially better, but you can still lose in them. So it's not a money... Whoever buy, spends the most money on the game wins. They have it a little easier, and you can get some cool-looking ships... I got a hole in the middle of mine. Actually, a torpedo went right through there one battle. I'm going to turn my broadside to this guy here. Engage him with two broadsides of missiles. Like that. That ought to give him a little damage. And fire a nuclear missile at him. Finish him. So, I just got hit by my own nuclear missile. Um, I'm trying to deal as much damage I can to these guys. Oh, that was a nuclear missile that hit right next to me. That's what that giant explosion is. I'm gonna fire mine there. Just gotta survive long enough to drop all those missiles out. There was the nuclear bomb. Hopefully, I'm far enough out of that range. And I died. So that's what I mean. Eventually, I'll get taken out. No matter which ship I'm using. There was a nuclear bomb there. But. You can defeat a ship. This hammerhead here, I've defeated that ship I was just using there. I think it is worth spending a few bucks on the game. I got the one which is usually $10 and a bunch of gold for very low. Here's one of that ship. I'm going to try to take it out because it's probably got nuclear missiles. I will take it on with these long-range torpedoes. I've been up oh, somebody just killed them. That's what I mean, though. Oh yeah, it also has, because it had the missiles on there, it gets a bonus. This ship here, I think also has broadside guns, I think I said that before, but um, they aren't that good. See, um, we're slowly taking that guy down. I'm going to go and lower to engagement height here. You want to stay kind of level and kind of behind. People don't look on their six as much as they should. If you see someone, you should definitely always check your six. Um, oh, those missiles are going to shred me. Those are hornets. I th think they're like rare, maybe. They might not even be common, but they're actually quite effective. So, um, Skullmaster. He's the only ship left. You can use all your ships in a battle, but you usually don't get the chance to. This battle is quite close. Um, here's one of my favorite... No, oops, wrong one. I'm going to, to rise up to attack this guy from behind. Again, he's t engaging that one there. He's not going to check his six. I have a fairly fast ship, so I should be able to get within range before he kills them. The reason I like this game a lot is because you have all dimensions. 
up, down, forward, backward. By the way, if you want to go backwards, the thing that says 99, you swipe that the other direction. I'm going to go right here and fire these missiles. I'll hit him and come here. And, oh, crap. This guy's good. What ship is that? It's a good ship, too, but he's also a very good player. Oh, I got four health there. That was really close. I think that was all the ships. Yeah, that was so close. That was his last ship, I think. I killed his first one. I'll check back in the recording. I think I'll do one more battle, and that will be it for now. Um, I'm If slash when anyone looks at these videos, tell me if you think what games do you think I should do. Give me any suggestions. I don't have a computer, so I can only do iOS games. I don't have an Android either, so... This one they just released on iOS. It's been out for a while on Android. I can only do iOS. But any games you find that you think would be good, I will try out for the video. Um, I'm uh, that recording the little. There was a electric thing there, like a plug. That's your. That's if you have fairly bad connection. This iPad doesn't get great connection. Um, I think this will be the last video battle I'll do for this video. Um, I might make a few more of these because there are no good videos on this. Hopefully this one will be good. Um, no actual talking. It's usually just them playing music in the background. I find that, I think that's fine. And I might do it in one or two, but I don't think it's the funnest. Um, you can't you can't learn tips from that. And here I'm gonna dive down at this guy. I will do ship reviews. I think I think I can do ship reviews on this, where I will go and test out the ships and like do I might do verses, um, doing which ship I think's better. So if anyone plays this, they can see side which ship they want to get because they're quite a few in each class and some of them are pricey um i think this will be the last video the well, I mean, the last battle for this video i'm just talking i can't talk straight i'm firing those missiles at him when i get each time i get a new class i will probably make another one tomorrow i have had a little break where i haven't made any videos for the past little bit, but that was because when I went to record one, my game kept crashing. So, I think that this will be the last ship I will get to use in this battle. I won't get to use the hammerhead again, because by the time you can check the points in the top, I can use this thing right now, um, there and there, Red team's the enemy, and they're going, their points are quite low, and ours are quite high, which means they're almost out of ships. I'm going to come up here to engagement range. At close, you can see people's health bar. At long, you can't. Um, these guys are a lot closer. I will fire a nuclear missile at them. Oh, there was the nuclear bomb. Oh, that guy got hurt from it. That's what I mean by that. I'm checking down here for him to respawn in. He should spawn in about 10 seconds. Um, I think that might go... Yeah, you know what? That actually goes down. That bar there is like their teammates altogether. Robots left or ships. So, wait. Fire, fire. Hornets. Hit him. Hit him, man. Damn. Oh, my horns just went right through. I think this is probably a win. Yeah. Back to hangar. So, that's it for this video. Well, I have to go back and turn off my recording app. But, 
You know, I think I might be able to do that from here. I'll try that sometime when I'm not. I think this is probably a fairly good vi video. So, oh, carbon leak. Yeah, you get a bunch of money for stuff like that. And I s oh, I got a bunch of money. I'll show you quickly how to upgrade stuff before I go. The only reason I'm upgrading this ship so high, it's only a destroyer class, but that's because it costs real money. So I don't see any reason for doing this percent thing. I've never had it actually fail, but I feel like it can because it says chances, but it will go down, I guess, each time. Oh, I'm out of money to upgrade stuff. But this ship here has, I'm trying to upgrade it to max. I will probably come back with another video in, by tomorrow most likely, of these, um, other, oh, I already have them. These destroyer classes. I can't get, use this one, but I think I can get this one here and this one here. I will probably have gotten one by then. If anyone watches it before then, tell me which one you think I should get. One with two turrets and a bunch of missiles, or this one. I will probably get the one with a bunch of missiles, because I don't have any missiles. Anyway, that's it for this video, and I'm out. Well, not yet, but, like, almost. Uh, as soon as I click on here, and then click the stop, I'll be out. Anyway, bye!